Good evening and welcome to News Asia on the Net. Our topic today should really interest Debbie Wong because it's all about penises. You know who likes penises? Who? People who wear flowery shirts. I'm not gay despite my floral print shirt. In China, a monk named Shi Yan Wu has come up with a martial arts technique claiming to make men's crotches as hard as iron. In a demonstration video, Shi is shown being kicked repeatedly in the crotch as well as having another monk dangle off the end of his penis with a rope. Gay. Howard, monks can't be gay, they're asexual. Debbie, if you have a man hanging off another man's penis by a rope, that's as gay as it gets. You know what would be more gay? If he was wearing a flowery shirt. I wonder how that monk made his penis so invincible. Maybe a dose of Viagra and some heavy anesthetic? I think it's more like good porn. Because you know, good porn is very hard to come by. When I get the search results on porn, it's usually midget, grandma, animal, disgusting stuff. It's not very exciting for me. In other penis news, a 44-year-old Chinese man by the name of Yang had his penis chopped off during a domestic violence event. Tragically, only one centimeter of his former manhood remained. His life was miserable. His sex life was bad. <laughs> and he often had multiple urinary tract infections. <laughs> he eventually begged a doctor to perform penis transplant surgery on him, the first ever performed in China. However, a few weeks later, he requested penis removal. Apparently, his wife couldn't take it that it was another man's penis on her husband's. A domestic violence event? I wonder what happened. He must have cheated. Cheating men ought to be punished by castration! You can use it now, huh? You swanning bastard! Well, that's it for today. Protect your assets, boys. I'm Howard Lowe. And the psycho bitch on my right is Debbie Wong. Thanks for watching.